We wanted to find this island uh, and prove its existence or correct the map if need be because a lot of scientists depend on these maps. So for example, a lot of the weather maps include this island, which doesn't exist, uh, even though it, it's meant to be 26 kilometers uh, wide, which is much larger than any of the nearby islands which do exist. It's completely possible that it was a human error in digitizing these maps at some stage, and it's just entered the databases once, and it's stuck around inside the databases because no scientific vessels have actually been uh, in that region for a very, very long time. It's a very poorly explored part of the world, like much of our oceans, unfortunately. So it was a great opportunity for us to actually update the maps, update the data, and get a better understanding of the whole region and its tectonic evolution as well. The maps of Mars and the Moon are much higher resolution and coverage than what we have of our own oceans. So we really need to go back, send more vessels and research vessels out there to map the ocean floor and better understand what's out there.